we still learnt nothing. I had a chat with Diane. She said she was at the bar drinking with Nick at the time of the murder. We need and to confirm her Corroborate. Corroborate? Talk to Nick at the diner. Cooperate. Well, Agent Morgan. I have to head back to the department and clear up some paperwork. Okay. Go with Emily to the AMG diner. Okay. Okay. I'll show you the way. The diner's open from nine to twenty-one hundred. You, you got the knuckles? Just as we suspected, Zach. Diane is the key to this case. How? I have a feeling she will lead us right to the criminal. Oh, it's fucking. It's. That's Kason. Kason. F- uh, oh. Looks like the show has just begun. E- and it has an all star cast. Hi there. Hi there. Don't tell Jamie's ma'am about this, okay? Can I just go back in? Are they still chilling up there? No. Okay. They even show up on the map here. Uh, well. There's Deanne. Kason's not there for some fucking reason. I don't know. Before we crack on, what I want to do, if I can, for fuck's sake. God damn it! Why won't you let me do things? I just want to do a side quest. Let's get to the diner. I need to talk with Nick and Olivia ASAP. Maybe that's why. Maybe we're in the middle of the investigation. Is this gonna be the same car? I swear to god. If I get in this car and it's got the same fucking fuel level and... Emily, Jesus, do you why know are your eyes glowing? Forrest Kaysen? Kaysen? Yes, I, I know him. The, the sapling salesman, right? The sapling he salesman? He strange comparisons when he talks. What, I'd like to know what more are you about talking him. about? What does he do when he comes to town? He sells sapling. So I guess he sells things. Oh no, he's a sapling salesman. It's pretty confusing. It's a pretty mysterious, mysterious guy. Is that all? If you ask me, anyway. Well, now that you mention it, he seems quite friendly with the Ingrams, with Isaac and Isaiah. Oh great. Maybe you should ask them about Kason. Okay. Okay, so. I will. Okay, I will. Jesus, fine. If you're not gonna be fucking helpful. Oh no, this one's like full. That's okay then. Well, here we go again, guys. I'll get you. I'll I'll wake you guys up. I'll be your um. I'll be your alarm. You guys could go to sleep for the night. And by the time you come back, I'll have figured out where the fuck I'm supposed to go. Hopefully, Jesus Christ, I've got so. F <laughs> oh, 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 it's so far away. All right. So along the way. I decided that we're gonna jump out by here. Is there something you want to check out? Yes. Uh, well, either way, it doesn't matter. I can see you won't be rushed. I'm gonna go ahead, okay? Okay, that would be fine. Wait. The diner is open from 9 to 2100. Don't keep me waiting too long, okay? Yeah, that's just 12 hours. Don't keep me waiting too long, though. If you accidentally get out of your car, I can imagine... That would have been awful. Imagine if I accidentally got out of the car and she's just like, I'll meet you there, I guess. But yeah, we're going to go in here and we're going to do a little side quest, ladies and gentlemen. If Keith is here. Yeah, he is. It's that boy, Keith. Hey, bro. Coco gum. Cocoa gum? Cocoa gum. Okay. I mean, anyway, want to browse the merchandise, man? Got enough rocket stuff here. Just... Like it's just like a shop in the city. Sure, you'll find whatever you want. Check it out. Heard you have everything here. I heard you have everything here. Is that true? Oh, that's me talking. Of course. Oh, yeah. Don't forget what we got. Always get in trouble because my list isn't all that it's supposed to be. If, man, for any reason you don't like my list, I'm cool. I'm cool. Always ask Lily there. Her list always perfect. I'll keep them. I'll keep that in mind. Do you want to buy some? Is he just gonna stand there forever and do that? I'm not gonna wait and see. Hold on then. Let's see what he's got. Spiritual map A. That's what I want. All these weapons and shit, man. What else does he have? Does he have anything else that I want? Is that deep brew suit? It's a perfect suit if you want to be cool. Is it though? I want to see it. 
I'm not gonna see it, am I? Oh well. Maybe if I have to get some dry cleaning done. Spiritual map? Hey! Hey man! The spot on the map is called Cope's Tunnel. It's one of a couple of places in town where, like, spooky stuff happens. I'll tell you a story, okay, man? No. But, uh, Stop. don't go spreading it around. Spirits, they don't like publicity. Yeah, man, like spirits. Why is it so dark in here all of a sudden? <laughs> <laughs> this place was a I forgot! You know, the I fucking forgot! The was the main connection about this. from the lumber yard to this town. Every day, huge trailers Why the would like come in and out. Lots of traffic, dude. Uh, of course, some people were like all up now in the Now I'm arms, a ghost! Save our nature, stop pollution, you fucking you know, see this! Big business was pushing in here from all over the U.S. of A. Yeah. Everyone was bickering over the forest. Get back in the hole! So some of the town people see my got fingers? even more worked up, you That's know? That's they a really good line to have whilst I'm saying get back itself. in the hole. I guess maybe that was the start of all the bad times. Bad times. Oh yeah, man. Shouldn't this be Rough like a cutscene? Heavy times, man. The conservationists and the lumber workers faced off with each other. Neither side was backing down, and that made things worse. Yeah, man. Amid all this chaos, there was a man and a woman who got engaged. Uh huh. Problem was that the man was a lumberjack. And the woman, she was a tree hugger. Ah, uh, it's like Romeo and Juliet. Fought. Except but then, fucking, one morning, they you had know, a lover's quarrel. Modern, I People guess. People think that her love well, of nature clashed with his profession. Standards. But we'll never know what they really were fighting about that morning. No. The man shouted. He called her an idiot. And then oh. he stormed out and went to work. If only he had known, that would be the last word he would ever say to her. He, he, uh, he would ever said to her. When he finished his work for the day... He got in his car and drove home. When he got to the tunnel, he saw lantern lights glowing faintly. Uh -huh. Those fools, not again. He just thought they were protesting in the tunnel again. Uh -huh. And to scare them a little, he decided to speed up. Uh -huh. He probably thought they'd all scatter so he wouldn't hit them. But the lights didn't move. In fact, one came toward him. Yo. A second later, there was a thud and the lantern flew up into the air wow slammed on this his brakes really too late of course Fucking then where's that totally light coming freaked, from is that light coming from me happened i don't need to tell you who he hit do i what's more in her mangled hand there was a letter to the head of the lumber mill a peaceful settlement offer the woman had no other relatives oh. other than the man and the lumber mill took no responsibility for the accident it was going out of business anyways. What happened to the man then? No Surely one that's saw a reason that they should have. Some say he killed himself, or simply just vanished. You know, he might still be in the tunnel, weeping over his lost love. So now, some folks say there's a ghost of a young man that haunts the tunnel. Oh. I told you it was called Cope's Tunnel, right? Yeah. Well, check this out. Some people call it Corpse Tunnel now. <laughs> Be careful, Mr. FBI. If you go down there by No yourself. way! <laughs> no fucking way do they call it that. That's fucking cr- Thanks a lot, bro. That's scary. You guys scared? That's scared you guys, that scared me. Fucking scared the shit out of me. That was crazy. Anyway. Let's go and do that side quest, shall we? Because we're gonna get our hands on one of the most useful items in the game. Uh, we want to go to... Wait, is the lumber mill not on here? Why not? Why is the great why is the lumber mill not on here? I want to go there. We've been there before. Are you, are you serious? Where's the map? So I could go what that way is it? And then you go down into Corpse Tunnel or Cope's Tunnel, whatever the fuck it's called. Where am I? I'm here, so I can... Oh, that takes me all the way over this way. Jesus Christ. 
that way and then down there. Okay. We have a general direction to head. I will head over there and I will see you guys in a couple of minutes because apparently I don't have the fast travel for the old lumber mill anymore for some reason. Oh man. Here we are, the corpse tunnel. Hopefully we don't find Logan Paul recording something in here. That would be pretty scary. Is that joke dead? Pretty sure it's dead. Just like the boy guy in the tunnel. That's it. We're gonna find the joke. We're gonna find the Logan Paul joke in here, guys. Let's give this a shot. Ah! Okay. Uh, can I just... What's this? To leave? We shouldn't go any further. Let's go so We should not go any further! Let's go somewhere else, Zack. Let's stay together. Uh... Kill these guys, I guess? Let's see what happens? Oh shit. Put it down! What the fuck are you doing? What are you doing? I'm doomed. I'm doomed? <laughs> Kia! 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 Oh shit, no! Wait! Go! 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 Move! 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 No! Go! Age of- Oh, Jesus. This is risky business. They both dead? Seems like it. Now what? That oh, bullets, thank you. More auto bullets. Nah, no, it's a first aid kit. I'll take it. For that enormous finger. And then we'll finish him off with this, eh? Yes. yes. Let's do it! Yeah! Give me more. More bullets. Okay, we did it. Now what? Is that the end? Oh, here we go. What's this? Is that just more bullets? Oh, it's a stabilizer. Clean your inventory. Okay, I guess I'll just toolbox it then, eh? Thank you. Well, now what? Do I go through the door? Is that where I'm supposed to go? Or is this the exit? No? Well, can I just go back? No? It's locked, is it? I have to beat the bot, beat these goobers, and then I'm allowed to leave. Beat the goobers first. Yes, a bullseye. Yes, Isn't this just fucking amazing, guys? This combat? Isn't this just fucking horrifying, this game? Aren't you worried about my safety? Whether or not I'm gonna make it out of this situation alive? Yes. Amazing. Amazing. It's just horrible, isn't it? I mean, horrifying. Thanks for the more bullets. Hello. I did it. It was me. Thanks for the bullets. We must be full on bullets by now, or at least, like, pretty much full. What is that, a medium med kit? Can I take? No. It's a large one. So we'll just toolbox it, I guess. Now what? Well, that's the leaving thing. That's one more stapes. 
Yeah, we don't need more stabilizers. They're fucking worthless, basically. Let's get out of here. Oh, look at that! I thought that was gonna be a fucking ring. Like a fucking, like, wrestling ring in the middle. And I was gonna have to wrestle with Bone Saw from fucking. Uh, Spider Man 1. And I was gonna ask if his boyfriend made his outfit. And then everyone was gonna get upset with me about it. Because that doesn't age very well. That's what I was going I, I mean, how much better would this have been if that was what happened? <laughs> Ow! <laughs> Fucking hell. Look at all these items everyone's dropping. What's that? First aid kit, auto bullets. Might as well take the auto bullets, eh? Pack myself up. What's that? First aid kit, small. Grab one of you. Everything else can just stay the fuck away. I'm just wasting time, I feel like, at this point. What's that? A root beer. Yeah, I might as well take it. I don't have one of those, so... There's no reason not to. Is this what you expected, guys, when we went to the Psychic Spot A? Like, when I say Psychic Spot A, is this what you imagined? Because this is exactly what I imagined. You may be wondering why I'm even bothering to do this and why I'm showing you. Believe me. It'll be worth it. Trust. Trust me, okay? Look at all the shotgun shells that I'm not gonna pick up. I don't need the bullets either. For any of you who haven't played this video game at all, you're probably like, why aren't you bothering to pick up any of these items or bullets? Oh, you'll see. You're a terrible shot, lady. Die! You guys suck. You're not dead? Is that it? What's this? Is it a flare? Yeah, it's a flare. Thank you. And now to the next room. I swear to god, if there's another room, I'm just gonna skip the shit out of all of these. Cause it's it doesn't it doesn't change, guys. Nothing? It's fucking nothing, guys. What we get? Is this the item that I've been waiting for? Yeah it is! Submachine gun infinite. God fucking damn it, my inventory! What is with me and these fucking survival horror games in my inventory? Oh gee, I wonder what I'm gonna fucking throw away. Uh, go on here. Throw this away. Throw all these away. Then pick up you, the infinite submachine gun. Look at that, 360 bullets and it's fucking infinite. This is gonna take us through the rest of the fucking game. Yeah! The map of Psychic Spot A has been completed. Now where the fuck am I meant to go? I've forgotten already. I was so stuck in my own little world, though. What's that opposite? The bank. Is that the sheriff's department? Yeah, it's opposite the sheriff's department. So, if we just, uh, quick teleport over there. Uh, items. And then we can just do a quick little teleport over to there. By heading over to... The sheriff's department. That legendary fucking whim. If I ever saw one of them in the- <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry. I can't help but smile and giggle a little bit every time I hear that. If I saw a whim like that in my fucking back garden, I would never leave my house again. Might as well just run over there at this point. What the fuck is that? One day I will find out what that noise is. 
we will see it for ourselves. Let's head over to the diner, I guess. Hey, Abilie. Oh, there's that flapping noise again. Emily, were you waiting outside for me? Where else was Should she gonna I fucking have be? Gone inside and started the twenty questions. Yes. Well, that would have been fine with me. Except for. Shall we get something to eat then? Someone should teach you how to be more considerate. So don't fucking speak to the to eat? question somebody. Oh, don't question fucking me. question anyone with me because I like to see people myself. But also when I'm not here, why the fuck didn't you question? Why didn't you do it? Welcome, Mr. Agent. Fucking hell. Hi, Olivia. Let me have your special for today. And some fresh coffee. Our special today is turkey. Nice. A turkey and gravy sandwich. Sound good? I will sound good, actually. Perfect. I haven't eaten yet today. Emily, you eat something, too. It'll be on the FBI. That's sick. Okay, then. I'll go all out. I'll have the T-bone steak. Ooh. I usually can't order it because it's a little too expensive. <laughs> yeah, just waste the FBI monies. It's fine. <gasps> Do we get this cutscene? Oh, please, this is a yes. I am here for Mr. Stewart's lunch. If it is ready, I thank you a bunch. It sounded like you didn't know what to say yeah, then. He's like, I uh, thank you a bunch. Here you go. The usual. One turkey, strawberry jam, and cereal sandwich. That sounds amazing. I'm starving, sounds so I'd like fucking the eat that. Sandwich. Self-inflicted punishment to atone for past sins. He's setting an example. Uh-huh. Mr. Francis York Morgan, uh -huh. you should try this wonderful lunch. It's more than a delicious, tasty crunch. What do you mean it's more than a delicious, so tasty says crunch? Mr. Stewart. Yes, I No, did. that's fine. I've just ordered my own lunch. Okay. Why don't you tell him that it's fucking really good, please? I then give it my dick a Mr. Squeeze. Francis York Morgan, I, that is, Mr. Stewart's order is delicious, I should mention. And Mr. Nick Cormack is a genius for creating this he, perfection. He made it? So says Mr. On Stewart. papers? Are you serious? Yeah. I have a hunch I might not like it. Are you sure that sandwich is that good? What cereal is it? Tell him it's fucking great. How many times do I have to fucking say? I thought tell him he's really gay. Mr. Francis York Morgan. Making decisions based on intuitions is always a sign of bad FBI agents. So says Mr. Stewart. I didn't even rhyme that time! Harry, you're right. I'll give it a try. <laughs> oh, look how delicious that looks. Looks like someone threw up onto it. Hmm? <gasps> Holy shit! Mm, I can't believe it. This is fantastic. What is this music? It's really good. Olivia. Don't want to be an American, I'm sorry, idiot. Change my order. I'll have what Harry is having. That's actually what it sounds like. <gasps> oh! Jesus Christ. Yeah, just get those fucking fingernail shavings. Nick and Diane. They hardly make the perfect couple, do they? What do you mean? Is it widely known that they go drinking together, just the two of them? To be honest, I don't pay attention to these things. Not into local gossip? Well, when I moved here, I was still in high school. And so? I kept wearing the same wild clothes from my school in Seattle. So? I was young back then. And before I knew it, there were rumors all over the school. She'll screw anyone. Oh. That's what they said. Totally unfounded, of course. Anyway, after that, I just a beer in the middle of the day? Really trust gossip. Look at it! I have a, like, cup of milk, it looks like, and there she is with a fucking beer. I get where you're coming from. I used to dress like a hardcore punk rocker when I was in high school. Yeah. Oh! Used to have the big spikes. <laughs> you? A punk rocker? 
<laughs> Nobody the liberty took my spikes. Side. Even when I had good grades, people rejected me just because of what I wore. I was young back then, too. <laughs> Even still, I just don't see you as a punk rocker. Really? So you told you me laugh? something in confidence. Look at you. No makeup on. Dressed in uniform, eating a steak for lunch. What the fuck has that got to do with anything? Okay, back to work. Let's talk to Nick. This game is fucking strange. What a mysterious game this is. Honestly. I told you that in confidence. Now I have to kill you. Where's Emily? She's over there. I'm trying to kill you with my infinite fucking submachine gun. Come here, you fucking loser. What do you mean? I didn't do nothing. Ow. Oh, she just dodged. Look at it! Nice. Let's get a good shot of that, shall we? You see a dodge, guys? I barely even saw it. Look at it! You see how quick that was? I couldn't even see it! Look at everyone dodging these bullets! They're so quick! That's amazing. Let's reload this, shall we? Anyway, can I not talk to you? Could, do I have to talk to a... Diana claimed to be drinking with Nick on the day of the murder. Oh, I need to talk to Nick then. I wonder what Olivia was doing then. No, I have to talk to Olivia? Oh, okay, so I had to do it in the right order first. Olivia, I was wondering if you could tell me what the A and G stands for. <laughs> ah! That fucking hurts my ears. Apple and gravy. My husband's always been proud of his special gravy made with applesauce. So when we were setting this place up, I'm so sorry guys for anybody who's wearing headphones like I am at this point. We made that name, Apple and Gravy. Nick's father suggested we put something we're proud of in the name. But apparently, orgies and cocaine was not suitable, so we just chose Apple and Gravy instead. I'd like to ask you a little about Nick too. Ow! A little is okay. Like what? Nothing major, just a few things about him and Diane. Ah. Burr. No? Nothing? Did you have a chance to talk with Nick? No, not yet. Something you wanted... Don't want me to hear from him? No, no, it's nothing. Okay, so definitely then, in other words. The fuck is Nick? Let's go back in here. Let's talk to Nick. You done shaving your fucking nails with that knife? What's up? You tell us what you were doing on the night Anna was killed? I was at the bar with Diane. What do you two talk about, Nick? Our butts. Rembrandt and Tina, is that a problem? No, no problem. Think of Di If you think Diane did it, you're wrong. Why? No, that's not it. Oh, so it's me you're after then, is it? You're wrong again. So much for the FBI, huh? But I didn't say it was either of you. Well, that isn't the case either, Nick. So you're the idiot, not me. I think there's something both of you are hiding. You can tell what people are hiding something by their reactions. For some reason, that he looks like a character model from The Walking Dead there. I don't know why. Eyes, tongue, hand movements, sweat, dry lips. Le neck angles. I thought I said neck ankles and such. Tongue? Really? Is somebody's lying? Are they just like, Yeah, I was just uh, hanging out with my friend. <laughs> I'm walking here! Why, why are you doing the George animation? I bet you in the files that's literally called the George animation too. You ain't ordering? Get out! But I'm the FBI, you can't tell me to get out. You literally can't. I already told you I could tell you. Don't make me say the same thing twice. Okay. I guess he can tell the FBI agent. He can just tell the FBI to fuck off. There's something I'd like to confirm with you, Olivia, if that's okay. Yes. Well, so long as it doesn't take too long. First, what were you and Nick doing on the night of the murder? 
I was here in the diner. Nick said he was going to the bar for a couple of drinks. Look at him shaving his fucking nails with the... That's disgusting. Does he go to the bar often? Crunch. Leaving you to hold up the fort? Yes. Y yes. He says he enjoys the conversation with Diane. I thought they went drinking again together that night. Yeah. Do the three of you ever go drinking together? No. Well, you see, I I'm really not into art. That's a good excuse. And your husband is well versed in the arts then, I take it. Sure. Oh, yes. Um, looking at art and talking about it is his way of relaxing. <laughs> People just aren't what they seem. Sure. Like a certain someone who was into punk rock ten years ago. Shut up! You are absolutely right, Emily. But you can be an art lover and a liar at the same time. Ah, shit! One more thing, Olivia. You just said that you aren't interested in art. That's right. And... So, how come I bumped into you at the art gallery? Oh. Didn't seem like Nick oh. brought you there. You were there alone. Oh, no. I... Huh. Well... I like trees, is the thing. That's why I went there. Don't you mean painting? Surely you'd trees? be better off in the forest rather than an art gallery, then. Why are you being so uh, pedantic, Agent? I think you went to the gallery not to see trees, but to see Diane. Right? Uh, uh, why is there like a double ah? You don't want to answer. Or perhaps this isn't the right place to ask. Meet me in the backyard. You can get there from the parking lot. I'll wait for you there for an hour after we close up. What? What the fuck is that? Is that the key to this place? The key to backyard. They close at 2100. Should we get something to drink and wait? Yes. Oh, thank you for asking me. Oh, they looked at me as well. They were like, do you want to do that? Person playing video game? Agent York, what do we do now? I you just said you wanted to wait around! Saying. Let's kill time until the diner closes. Okay, then I'm gonna make a trip back to the department. I'll see you in the backyard later. Well, what am I okay, supposed to sounds do? sounds good. See you later then. Bye! Back about Olivia. Uh-huh. I presume she wants to tell us something about Nick and Diana. Yeah. Let's hope it's not just something for the gossip cops. It's probably just that they're having an affair, let's be real. Oh shit, I have so- Look at how much time I have to sp Ugh. It's like 11 hours in this game, fuck. I'm pretty sure the minutes go by like... This case, son. Is he stopping here? Fucking hell. I think the minutes actually go by like real minutes too, so I'm gonna have to like... Figure out something to fucking do in the meantime.